Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Pokemon Coliseum. Uh, let's go ahead and head on out. Hopefully no audio issues. Uh, still working on trying to fix the first episode's audio, but uh, the last time I checked it was not 100% at the very beginning. It, got, it, it fixed itself after like, I don't know, like 60 seconds or something like that, but let's talk to Willie real quick. Oh hey, it's you. I was worried about you. Some rough looking characters came around asking about you. It made me worried. Those, or those guys, they look like they're from Team Snag'em. Let's go get ourselves some Pokeballs. Listen, pal, if you're intending to travel some more, you might want to stock up on supplies here. Hi, can I ask you something? Don't you, don't you sell any Pokeballs? Huh? Pokeballs, you say? There's no call for those things around these parts. Where'd I put them now? Oh yeah, here they are. A little dusty. Okay, chair. I'm afraid, but otherwise perfectly usable. Here, take these. I'll let you have them for free. Nice, bro. Five Pokeballs. Well, since I found them, I may just as well put them out with the rest of my merchandise. If you need some more, well, how about buying them from me? Yes. Well, let's see here. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Let me buy 10 first here. Hold on. Does it give you Premier Balls in this game? Yeah, it does. Okay. I want to get four. Because I want to be able to catch whatever I want. And I don't need that money that we have. So, let me buy, let me buy one more set of these. Oops, no. There we go. There we go. Stop at five, $5,000. Alrighty. Let's head on out. Okay, now where am I supposed to go? Uh, hold on. Okay, that flashing red thing, it means I need to be here. Uh, where? Hold up, where am, what am I supposed to be doing right now? Oh, I need to watch this thing on the news, okay. We've just received breaking news. According to the arrested Snaga member, the smaller Snag machine is compact enough to be carried by a single person. Wearing this machine transforms ordinary Pokeballs into Snag Balls. A Snag Ball is an alarming device. It can actually steal Pokemon from their trainers. It is hoped that the missing Snag machine will not be used for criminal purposes. I promise you, I'm not using for criminal purposes. Alright, so now I think we're good. Now we head out here. Or not? Wait, who do I need to talk to in here? Recently, there's been nothing but bad news. I wish there'd be a good piece of news that would brighten up the day for everyone. Yeah, the news is always depressing. Dude, sorry to break it to you. Oh, so some thugs gave you a rough time? There wasn't anyone like that in the old days. Isn't it terrible? Ah, so you've been to Phoenix City. Oh my, I'm quite surprised. You've already gotten yourself a girlfriend. Alright, well, if that's not who I need to talk to. I don't need... Oops, I don't want to... I don't need more of that. Okay, I talked to everybody in there. Uh, let me talk to Willie again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let me go back to Phoenix and talk to the mayor. I'm not exactly sure what I need to do now. I think I need to talk to the mayor. Oh, yeah, yeah, here we go. Oh, it's you two. Something terrible's happening. Okay, that was a horrible reading job on my part. A whole lot of scary men came here. I think I even saw those two creeps who took off in the truck earlier. All right, where are these guys at? They're either at the mayor's house or they're at, uh, they're up there. Are they at mayor's? Oh, you know what? I think they're around here to battle. Hold up. Get out of my way. Um, are they, uh, and maybe they're not. I thought they were around here to battle. Let's check up here first. Are they up here? No, they're not. 
Okay, so I think they're at the mayor's house. Let's go check that out. Yeah, here we go. Oh, it's Mirror B. Mr. Mirror B. It's, it, it's him. He's the one that took the girl from us. Mirror B has the, mo has the best music in the game. Oh, now aren't you boys f frightfully pathetic? You mean to tell me you were bested by these darling infants? Darling, did you say your name was Nick or something? I so don't like saying this, but we're not at liberty to keep your lady friend at liberty. That sweet young thing, she sees the things that ordinary people aren't supposed to see. That just will not do for what we're planning to do. No, it just won't do at all. If you don't like plain, or if you, if you don't like pain, like most people, you can avoid the pain by keeping your nose out of places it needn't be. Boys, oh boys. Yes, yes we will. Boys, I shall make my return to Pi right now. Do remember that I will be waiting for you to return with the little lady. Am I making myself clear? I won't accept failure from you again. Boys, foo ho ho ho. Let the music spin, let's get it on. Am I fighting Mirror B? Okay, no, no, I didn't think I fought him here. Alright, so I get to beat these two idiots again. You, 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 the last time you caught me off guard, that's not gonna happen again. No, Alright. You scare me. Peon fully, be peon fully. Wismer and Lotad. When do I get to catch my first Pokemon? Is it here? It's here. It, no, 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 it's not here. Alright, Umbreon and Espeon. Let's take this man out nice and quick. Uh, let me bite Wismer. I'm just gonna take out Wismer first. I'm just gonna make sure Wismer goes down. Alright, one shot. Creeping up towards the next levels. Alright, Umbreon. Take Lotad out for me. Why is Umbreon so weak? Lotad used Astonish. Wow, that did a lot of damage. That's like the most damage anything's done to us this whole time. But it's time for you to go to sleep, Lotad. What do you gotta say for yourself now, Foley? Oh, it's Mirror B Peon Foley. Okay, I was reading that wrong. And I missed his dialogue. It said aw something about losing. I was having the realize realization that I was saying his name wrong. My turn now. I'm not going to end up like Foley. Do you have the first Pokemon I can catch? Mirror B Peon Trudely. Ooh, Duskull and Spinarak. Ooh, give me, give me Duskull. I think it's Spinarak. No, never mind. I'm trying to remember stuff and I'm just clearly, I clearly don't know what I'm talking about. I'm trying to remember stuff and I'm just wrong. Alright, this should, yeah, okay. I was going to say, that's not going to take out Duskull, but I don't want to bite Duskull. That's not going to do much. So we'll go about it this way. It'll take me two turns to take him out. And Spinarak flinch. Nice. Uh, okay, I don't know why you use that on Umbreon. Usually they target the weak one. Let me bite Spinarak. Confusion on Duskull. Usually they, they target like Espeon. They just straight out attack Espeon. Alright, Duskull down, and Spinarak should be down right here. Take him out, Umbreon. Oh, Mokuhita, is this the sh Shadow Pokemon? Yes, it is. Nick, it's that one, that Pokemon. These jerks captured me because I saw that Pokemon. I can see a black aura coming from it. They must have done something to that Pokemon. I don't want Mokuhita. Nick, be careful. This Pokemon isn't afraid to attack people. I know, Nick. I hate to say this, but there's no other choice. Get that Pokemon back from the bad guys. Please, you have to. 
You can. Actually, only you can do it. Yes, because I have the snag them. All right, spinner axe out. Now it's on to Makahita. Um, I don't know how much damage I'm going to do to Makahita. I don't want to knock it out. Let me bite it, since I know bite is weak. And I'll throw a Pokeball at it straight up here. Go ahead and throw the Snag Ball. Oh, I am so, I am so clutch. I am so MLG. It's not, it's not even funny. Defeated Mirror Mir Beat Peon Trudley, Trudley. What, my Pokemon? Man, you suck, Trudley. Nick got $600, woohoo. I'll slowly get rich off of beating these two idiots. Darn it, but you're good. You snagged my Pokemon. Hey, what are you saying? You're not supposed to be impressed. Oh, man, what are we supposed to do? We got flattened again. Mirror B's going to chew us out. What do we do? What is there, ty what is there to do? Run away! All right. Run and hide. Like, you did it, Nick. You snagged that Pokemon from that goon. But I'm sure there are others like it. Let's get all of them back from the bad guys. Yo guys, we are back. Uh, sorry, had a little bit of a crash uh, real quick there, So, but we are back now. Should be good to go. Um, you guys didn't miss anything. I just went down there and saved when the uh, recording software crashed so that I could reset it to where we were, or I'd have a reset point just in case. Uh, so we... I could fight him. I think he gives me Bayleaf. Can I fight anybody else? I think you can choose, isn't... Okay, so he get He gives, uh... Does that guy give Cinequil? I kind of want the Feraligator evolution. Hold up. Let's come down here. I always get the Bayleaf evolution... Or the Magnium evolution. Because I like Bayleaf, but... Let me do this. Sorry to break it to you, but I'm not about to let you pass. Or do you have this idea that you could take me in a battle? Wah ha ha ha! You, who's going to beat me? You are? Don't be crying out of regret later. Alright, let's roll. Looks like the audio and everything looks like it's recording good. Hopefully, Croconow should be the one I can catch. I'm gonna pop open my Snapple here, get something to drink, because I did actually record another like 10 minutes um well i mean i like reset and then recorded 10 minutes and then it jacked up again so i've been talking about actually recording for a while here all right so let's go ahead and catch this crocodile i'm just gonna try a pokeball straight off here i never catch this one if i catch anything usually i'll even go and catch the is it it's quilava i think i usually catch quilava i think next that's the other Pokemon that I potentially catch. I never really catch her. Okay, Croconaw. Alright. This should one-shot Grimer, I think. Oh, it didn't one-shot Grimer. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, that Shadow Rush is so powerful. Um, What do I want to do here? Depends on who gets hit with a Sludge. Okay. Okay, that did more damage than I thought, too. Alright, Umbreon... Bite Grimer. Espeon, let's throw another Pokeball at Croconaw. Come on, game. One, two, three! Got him, let's go. Spoink. There should be an easy knockout on Spoink. They should take out Grimer. Alright, Norton Live Update is available. Alright, thank you. I don't need that right now. It was like flashing on my screen over there. I was like, what the heck is happening? 
and it's just like, update your Norton! Which I, it, it set to update tonight anyway, so I don't know why it's freaking out over there. But that's not related to the video. Hopefully this bite will be super effective and finish off the Splink. I'm not backing on it, because Umbreon hasn't really impressed me, and yeah, see, see, Umbreon can't even one-shot something it's super effective against. I'm like four levels higher then. And then he's an idiot and used <sighs> a move that doesn't affect Umbreon. Alright, thanks for the Croconaw. The other guys disappear. I wish you could actually catch all the starter... Um, I don't even know what game those are the starters in. They were the starters in... They were the starters in Heart Gold and Soul Silver. Or, it would be Gold and Silver. Gold and Silver were the original games. Heart Gold and Gold Silver were their remakes. Mystery Troop Baluno. You, you, you're tough. Trudley and Folly can't be blamed for... I think it's a losing. Or for... Or something like that. You guys know what I'm talking about. What was that strange Pokemon? What did you people do to it? That? It's a Pokemon that we turned into a fighting machine by artificially closing the door to its heart. No, you didn't. You artificially closed the door to that poor Pokemon's heart? Hmm. <laughs> Knowing that's not going to help you do anything. I know. When I was little, I heard about that. They say that if any Pokemon closes the door to its heart, it can be gradually reopened by battling together with it. Nick, let's go. Those guys are probably headed for Pyrite Town. After all, it was in Pyrite that they captured me. Alright, hold up. We need to go... We need to go heal our Pokemon up, because they took some heavy damage there. Let me know what you guys think of the thing on the side, I guess. Um, there's not a whole lot that fits. Like, while there is a black bar on each side... There's not a whole lot that fits with that black bar, so I thought that was about the best thing that I could put over there. It shows our party Pokemon, and it's not really... I don't think it needs to be flashy or anything. I think it just looks nice, clean, and that's about all I think I need. Okay, so we gotta go to the construction lot first here. Alright, I guess we can talk to these construction workers. Whoa, hold it there. This is a construction site. It's not a safe place to be. This is no place for tourists to visit. Go on, scram. A up. It's been a mighty long time. I can't rightly recall when it was that I was last at home. But we're just about done here. All that's left is to clean up the site, and we're done. Ah, I've been working hard, I have. Let me tell you, making this here huge tower is one massive job. It's hard to imagine, even for me. Y'all come back to visit when we're all done here. There'll be a coliseum on top of the tower. Amazing stuff. I find it funny that two of them are nice, and then the guy right at the entrance is... He's a little douche McGruber. Alright, pirate town. Or pyrite town. Pirate town. Why does it always seem like when I need to read... Like, I have to do some sort of reading, like, with what I'm doing right now. I have to read all the dialogue. I always mess stuff up, like, I forget how to read. Aw, oh, Mr. Johnson, give a man a break here. I keep telling you I don't know anything. That better be true, Kale. If you're trying to con me, I'll know about it. Mr. Johnson, sir, I wouldn't think about lying to you. You've got to believe me, right? All right, fine. I'll let you off easy today. See ya. Hey, 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 what a nitwit. Of course I haven't got a thing to tell you. What are you looking at? I haven't seen your faces around these parts. What are you, t t terrorist? I almost said terrorist. <laughs> ah, if you don't want to get hurt, you should get lost and quick for the good of your health. Hee 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 hee. You're such an idiot, Kale. This is Pyrite, the town of Earth, wind and money. You appear to be outsiders. You had best beware. There are many ne'er do well sorts here. Uh, fortune telling, I guess we can come in here. I forget what this does for you. People call Fateen, the mother of Pyrite. Her ability as a fortune teller is highly regarded. Why, just a while ago, she even determined where my wife is living since she left me. <laughs> Stop. Sad story, dude. I'm sorry about your wife leaving you. Find what you seek, be it in an object, person, or luck. Welcome to Fateen's fortune telling chamber. I am Fateen. If every problem clouds your brow, you shall come to me. 
Uh, whatever your pro- oh, no, wait, I thought, <laughs> I thought I hit the A button, I was like... Okay, Fateen, you are worthless. Get out of my way, there we go. Alright, what is next? We've got- let's talk to this guy first, I guess. Hmm, you thugs must be Mirabee's newest recruits. Well, shoot, beat it. I don't have any money to give to the likes of you. I'm not quite sure how we look like Mirabee's newest thugs, but okay. Ow, 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 I'm, I'm sorry, Chief, but there's trouble afoot. You see, Chief, there's talk that thugs have been witnessed using strange Pokemon. Huh? Chief? You're not the Chief, I beg your pardon. I'm here, Johnson. That story isn't new, I've heard about it over and over already. Oh, oh, Chief, there you are. You're such a kidder. Ah, ha, 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 ha. You're such an idiot, Johnson. Uh, let's talk to him. My name's Sherless. I'm the chief of police in this town. Are you two travelers? I see. Well, whether you are or not, it would be best if you were to get out of town as soon as possible. This town descended into a state of lawless chaos. I couldn't guarantee your sacred safety if anything were to happen. Let's talk to Johnson. I'm Johnson. I'm the law around here. Oh, I are you now. It's my job to uphold the peace in this town. Man, do I feel safe with you protecting me. Alright, now, we got these two idiots over here. What? Not you two again. Listen, you have to promise, don't tell me or me that we're hiding out here, okay? After we blew our last chance, we couldn't go back, so we turned ourselves in for stealing that truck, and here we are. If we stayed here, we'd be safe. Hee 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 hee. You two are just idiots. Okay, okay, I know, I know, stop. I don't think I can talk to this guy. No, I can't reach far enough to talk to him. Okay. I thought there was an item in one of those cells, but I don't think there is. Alright, so next building here. What is this? I forget what this is. Oh, okay. Are you trying to sell me something? Well, sorry, I don't need anything. Please leave. Pyrite Town's always had a history as a rough town. With all the muscle-bound roughnecks about, that's not a surprise. But when Duking was in charge, there wasn't any of this lawlessness that you see today. What's, what's come over duking? Okay, I could make like a really horrible joke. I guess I'll make it duking is ducking. Okay, that's like a horrible joke, but I don't know why I thought of it. Because you could read that as ducking. Okay, I don't want to go to there yet. I'll come back to that. This is a shop. They don't really sell anything of importance. Uh, potion, paralyze, heal. There's all sorts of stuff I want, but I don't have the money. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. I don't have any Pokemon anyways. Listen, if you were offered 10 potions for 10, do 10 pokey dollars, would you want them? Who wouldn't? If there was a deal that good, I'd keep it to myself. Ho, 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 you're so funny. Okay, what do we have? Okay, let me get, let me get three revives from you. Nope, that's all I wanted. Actually cost a lot of money. I need to start saving money for great balls and stuff like that. I need to start saving up. Let's talk to this guy. Yo, your outfit's kind of weird, but you're a trainer too, aren't you? Yes, I am. Good, that's okay then. I'll teach you about one of the few rules this town has. Here we have street battles rather than exchanging greetings. Didn't we just exchange it greeting? Isn't that what that just was? Sorry if you hear my chair. Get repositioned so I'm more comfortable. It makes that, I think I talked about the first episode, it makes that stupid noise. Okay, so Sentra and Taylo. I should be able to handle these two. Alright, so let's go ahead. Let's bite. Let's just take out Taylo first. I need to put uh, Croconaut in so I can get rid of it. Oh my gosh, really? I couldn't just one-shot Taylo? Whatever. Alright, Taylo down. Do you have another Pokemon or is it just... Oh, you do have another Poke Pokemon. Slacka! I think every Shadow Pokemon is level 30, so you should pretty much know when you got a Shadow Pokemon on the other side to catch. Um, let's see here. Let's, let's take out Sentret now. My OP Espeon. Please, Umbreon, don't screw this up. Please take the Sentret out. Thank you. 
I have seen uh, Umbreon here in this game not be able to do enough damage. It's really screwing up. Pursuit. I'll probably use that on Espeon. Still not a big deal, I don't think. Oh no, he used it on Umbreon. Dude, a whole one damage. Umbreon's gonna be level 29. Nice. So that'll be a good time to switch Umbreon out so that I can open Croconaw's heart. I have to get to that tree, though. That tree with the dude with the Pikachu, I think. And Slackoth is down. I'm waiting for some trainers to give me some difficulties. There we go, Umbreon level 29. I should probably get Umbreon to level 30 before I worry about opening up anybody's heart. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to get Umbreon to 30 and then I'll start opening up Pokemon's hearts. Chaser, Calda. Whoops, you are better than me. 520 for winning. I don't care about opening up um, Makahita's heart, but... I trip myself up, but you're not bad at all. Your Pokemon are tops, too. Foo, foo, foo. I can see it in your eyes. You're just like us. It's easy to see. All right. Um, let's switch Makahita and Croconaw. I think Croconaw has... Yeah, Mystic Water. I think they get their special items, each Pokemon. Each of those three, like, starter-type Pokemon. Okay, let me give Mystic Water back. Croconaw. Alright, and then this is the shop. We were just in there. Okay, so now we have this chick. Oh, look at what we have here. You're quite the hottie. Why don't you lose that wallflower with you and be my sweetie? You know what? If I could, I would trade her in for you. Wait a second. Who are you calling... Who are you to call me a wallflower? What about me makes me a wallflower? Ah ha ha, look at her, she's all serious. Uncool. I'm only testing out of bore or teasing out of boredom. A guy like him, he's not to my taste. Grr, that's it, I'm furious now. Nick, be a man, stomp her down. How is that being a man? Stomp who me? Ah ha ha, that's a laugh. Come on, then, I'll go easy on you. This whole battle here is just ironic. And you'll, I, I don't know why I remember, I remember some, um... I try to say. I remember some aspects of this game, and I remember this fight, and it's just a load of stupid irony. Alright, let's go ahead and bite Gulpin and Confusion Gulpin. I'm gonna take out Gulpin first. I think she has a Shadow Pokemon. But just remember the fact that she asked me to take it easy on her. Wait, that didn't knock Gulpin out? What is that? Gulpin must have survived with one HP. What kind of, what kind of hot trash is that, dude? That is some next level. It's gonna take me a while to get Umbreon up to 30. Alright. Zubat just not too worried about that. Alright. Okay, maybe I, she doesn't have a Pokemon for me to catch. I thought she had a Shadow Pokemon. Maybe I was just... Maybe I'm just mistaken. But Zubat's out for the count. And here comes the ironic part of this whole fight. Okay, you got all serious. Not that part. It's the, I guess it's the dialogue after the fight. 540 bucks, I'll take that. What kind of a man battles a frail girl like me without easing up? You're not going to win the hearts of girls that way. Remember, she was the one that... She was the one that said that I should take it easy on... Oh, Nick, it was here in this square that I saw that strange Pokemon. I tried to leave town afterwards, and that's when those creeps grabbed me. We should be careful. Even at the best of time, there's nothing normal about this town. Alright guys, so let's go ahead and do one more battle this episode. Had a little bit of an issue again. You guys probably saw, I probably just threw up like a Pokemon Coliseum thing for the audio, because I had the audio of me reading her. All that happened was we walked up to here and she said something and I read it to you guys. That's, a, that's about it. Uh, so now we're going to battle this guy and then we will call it an episode, I think. I'm really hoping I'm not going to have these issues with recording. I'm going to try to get it figured out here uh, after I'm done with this video, but 
let's go ahead and get this started. Ha ha ha, you're looking to battle with me? That's too funny. Come at me as if your life depended on it. Ha 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 ha. Ryder Vant would like to battle. Alright, let's do this. I know he has a shadow. Yes, it's that Mr. Evis. Let's go. I so want that Mr. Evis. Umbreon of Espeon. Let's do this. Okay, let's take out... I think I'm going to take out all the added Pokemon before you can try to catch Mr. Evis. I'm just going to eat the damage from Mr. Evis. Let's go ahead and get Zigzagoon out of here. Mr. Evis outspeeds us. That's bad. She might take out... Oh, okay, Espeon held on. That's big, because I need Espeon to be able to take out Zigzagoon here. Because she's the major damage dealer. Is my Espeon even a girl? First of all. <laughs> we'll see here in a second. Please be fainted, Zigzagoon. Don't, don't. Okay, good. Alright, is Espeon a female? No, she's a male. Alright, so I have a male, male. Es I'm, I'm just gonna refer to Espeon as the girl and Umbreon as the boy. That's just how it's going. Hopefully, Mistrevis. I don't know, does a dumb attack. Nope, she's Shadow Balling. Dang it, dude. That's the end of Espeon. There was no point in me healing Espeon. Ha <sighs> but that's Espeon down. That's not good. Let's send out Makahita as just some fodder. Should be able to absorb some damage along with Umbreon. Ooh. Ooh, nice damage right there. Skitty's gonna get a tackle. That actually did more damage than I thought. Makahita's actually getting its heart open pretty quickly. Let's go ahead and bite Skitty, and... Well, let's try a Pokeball on Mr. Evis here. If not, I can weaken her. At least Mr. Evis is a girl. I always think of Mr. Evis as a female. There's just, you know, some of those Pokemon that you think of as female Pokemon, and some that you think of males, like Clefairies and Jigglypuffs and Togepies, I always think is like female Pokemon. And like male Pokemon. I always think of like Makahita and Hitmonchan and Hitmonlee and Machoke as male Pokemon for whatever reason. Like Skitty, I think of as a female Pokemon. Alright, here we go. Umbreon Bite Mystery this. And let's throw another Pokeball. Alright, let's get Mystery this. Come on. I want Mystery this part of the squad. One and nothing. Alright. I can't bit I can't weaken them too much because they can do that shadow rush and do a lot of damage to themselves. Alright, Monkey Heat just got lit up. That's bad. There we go. Fight. And another Pokeball. Come on, game. Give me Makihita. Or not Makihita, give me Mistrevis. Give me Mistrevis. One. Oh my gosh, dude, Mistrevis. You suck. This is the end of Makihita. This is kind of bad. This is really bad. Alright. And, uh, I can't tell where my I couldn't tell where the the highlight was over what was over. All right, fight it again. Don't kill. Okay, good. All right, well here we go. Pokeball. Uh, I don't want to revive yet. Um, let me just call Croconaw. Come on, Mr. Edis. Get in the Pokeball. One, two. Oh, come on, Mr. Edis. Okay, good. That's good. That's an attack that doesn't hurt me and it can't hurt you, so I'm fine with that. Got 
I'm good with the I'm good with confusion confuse ray. I'll be fine if she uses it on my other Pokemon to, on Umbreon too. Just call cracking off. Come on, Mystery this. Be a good little Pokemon. No! Ah, dude. Mistrevis. Okay, good. Another Shadow Ball. I'll take that. Alright, Pokeball. Alright, let me call Crocodile again. Alright, come on. One, two, three, yes! Let's go. Let's go, God to Mysterious. I'm stoked about that. Player defeated Ryder Vant. Gow! Alright, 300 bucks for the W. Not a lot of money, but I'll take it. Wow, that was easy for you. Losing like that snapped me out of my hyper state. Did you know if a Pokemon goes into hyper mode, call its name and its head will snap back into reality? Why do the trainers here have those strange Pokemon? I'm sure of it now. The town's hiding a big secret. Alright, so we've got ourselves five members of the squad. Makahita just keeps getting moved down until eventually he'll get kicked off of the team. Alright, let's head to the hotel. Let's stay at the hotel stay in one of our ultra or ultra gorgeous suites and you'll be refreshed like you're brand new your pokemon too it's a mere a hundred dollars a night will you stay with us yes i will hope you enjoy your stay with us so did you get a good rest the next time you need to stay make sure it's right here at the pyrite super grand hotel again Alright, so I think that is going to do it, guys, uh, for this episode. Uh, hopefully we don't continue to have video issues with the recording GameCube, but I think I'm trying to manage it as well as I can. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.